With the ever-increasing advancements in technology and people being more and more fixated towards their computer or mobile screens, blindness has become quite frequent, and it is evidently seen that people have been wearing spectacles from a very young age. But the question arises, are spectacles the only solution? Can blindness be cured permanently? Is there a world-changing solution? Keep watching to know more and get all your questions answered. Hey everyone, and welcome back to our channel. In this video, we'll be talking about the world's first bionic eye, which can cure your blindness forever and has the capability to change the world. So let's hop right into the video. For the people who have no clue about bionic eyes and have been living under a rock, a bionic eye is a visual prosthesis, an artificial eye that can provide visual sensations to the brain according to the environment. It consists of electronic systems having image sensors, microprocessors, receivers, radio transmitters, and retinal chips. It is made for the blind or the visually impaired people who have damaged their optic nerves, which prevent the transmission of visual data from the retina of the eye to the visual cortex of the brain. It is a technology of the future which can even provide vision to the blind. Tufts Medical Center in June 2017 was the only medical center that became the first and only hospital in New England to offer implantation of the bionic eye, but as of now, the implantation facilities have become widespread. The potential to be able to see clearly has been taken for granted by mankind. There are more than 200 million visually impaired people in the world who are either partially blind or are completely taken over by complete blindness. The bionic eye is a medical advancement that many researchers and medical experts have come up with in order to fight blindness. The bionic eye made its first appearance in the movie Robocop. While the world is still not advanced enough to create a perfect bionic eye, the researchers are still trying to make an attempt at achieving the best they can. And as it seems, their attempts are making a breakthrough. Recently, a team of researchers at the Monash University has made an incredible breakthrough. The team of researchers have reportedly become successful in developing a generous bionic vision system, more popularly known as the bionic eye. The bionic eye developed by them can overcome the disabilities of their optic nerve by making an alternate path for transmission of visual data from the retina to the visual cortex of the brain. Researchers all around the world have been trying to cure blindness by coming up with various bionic solutions. However, none of them have been successful, and none of them have been able to make it to the market to help better people's lives. No other existing technology has been able to do this, which is why the bionic eye made by the Monash University has been making into the news as the New Age Scientific Miracle. They are quite confident with their project, since their project has been under development for about a decade now. Now let us understand the working of the bionic eye to get an understanding of how this miraculous invention actually works and how it will help the visually impaired. The bionic system consists in numerous items that work as a system altogether. It consists of a headgear, which has a special glass embedded with a camera in place of the glass lens. The camera, just like the normal ones, captures the images of whatever the person is looking at. The camera then sends the visual data to the processor mounted on one side of the headgear. The processor then takes the visual data coming as an input and processes it as a very vague, pixelated form of video and then outputs the same through a wireless transmitter. The image will then be seen by the visually impaired as a very basic pixelated form of an image. Therefore, while a normal person will look at an orange as an orange, the blind person wearing the bionic system would see the pixelated image of the orange like a circle of arranged pixels. The system also has a wireless transmitter, which will transmit the output from the video processor into a set of 9 mm thin tiles that will have to be implanted into the brain. There are almost 10 implants that will stimulate up to 43 points in the visual cortex. The tile contains electric circuits that will convert the data from the transmitter into electric impulses for the brain to be able to process it. The design was quite complex for the developers to be able to implement it as the implants of the headgear had to be very biomechanically comfortable as well as precise. It also had to be stable to enable the smooth transition from the wireless transmitter to the implanted tiles. The system sounds quite complex when it is heard in such a way. However, from an end user, the system is quite simple. The user will have to wear the headgear with the camera and the transmitter embedded. A set of 9mm tiles implanted in the brain that receives the signals from the wireless transmitter. 
That's it. Arthur Lowry, one of the researchers of the team at Monash University and also a professor of the said university, said that their design creates a visual pattern from the combinations of up to 172 spots of light, scientifically known as phosphenes, which in turn provides the information for the individual to navigate indoor and outdoor environments and recognize the presence of people and objects around them. The researchers have tested their product on three sheeps with very minimal side effects where they were successful in implanting a tile into the brain using a pneumatic inserter with a total of 2,000 hours of stimulation. This was one of the first long-term tests of a fully implantable cortical vision prosthesis in the world, and according to the team, the device was well tolerated by the brain tissue and did not produce any adverse health effects. They are now preparing to take it to the next level by trying to implement it on a human, which would be their first ever human clinical trial. This trial is expected to be done in Melbourne. They are making consistent advancements in their product and also science and have also been very successful. Currently, the team is looking to create a new commercial version of their product, which will be focused on providing vision to the people whose blindness cannot be treated with ease. The researchers have now also focused their efforts into advancing their system to help people who have untreatable neurological conditions like depression, paralysis, epilepsy, etc., they are also looking for funding for their miracle of a product. So if you or anyone you know who can be of some help, please reach out to them. It is for a genuine cause. With extra investment, we'll be able to manufacture these cortical implants here in Australia at the scale needed to progress to human trials, said Marcelo Rosa, professor of physiology at Monash and MVG member. Tech giants like SpaceX and Tesla have already been working on a similar device through their brain chip startup Neuralink. It is devices like these that will benefit the people by separating their disabilities which have been keeping them down for years. Individuals around the world have been dealing with various eye complications and the invention of the bionic eye could solve this issue on a very large scale. Let's hope that the bionic eye from the Monash University becomes as successful as possible and makes it to the market as soon as possible. Do you think the bionic eye is the future? How sooner do you think the product will make it into the market? Isn't implanting a chip in the brain risky? Can a bionic eye be a doom to mankind? Stay tuned to our channel to get all your questions answered. Well, that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed watching the video, then make sure to hit the like button and make sure to comment below. Your comments are valuable and it helps us in staying motivated. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss another update on such amazing technological inventions. With that being said, let's meet on another video. Until then, see ya!